Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Super happy to see everyone here. So, this is the part two of our Mega Sale Eleganza Extravaganza. We're in during the part one where I have shown you what we are selling, which includes fashion jewelry, luxury accessories. If you haven't seen that, guys, I'm going to link it up here and also on the description box. So please do watch that after this episode because for this episode guys this would be what everyone's been waiting for so i'm going to show you what we would be selling today with our luxury bags hi guys ron here soaking budget and fashionista a vlog about the latest news about fashion i do luxury shopping vlogs hauls and unboxing i also do bag reviews and provide styling tips i'm inviting you to join our growing family by clicking this cute little icon here and i would be more than happy to welcome you to our growing and loving family also please do follow me on instagram.com forward slash ramirify so you can get daily updates and styling tips coming from me. so again guys the reason why we are doing this sale this is part of the our celebration where we have just reached our 1,000 subscribers again thank you so much for your love and support so for this guys um, most of the luxury bags that I would be showing you for today would be from my personal collection so I would be detailing all of the bags as much as I could so I'll be putting the name maybe the name and the prices and a little bit of description I will just be putting it here maybe here or here um, but guys, if you would want more photos or um, let's say the measurement, please message me via Instagram. Um, send me a direct message so we could get in touch or you could also send me an email. Alright, so this would be very, very fun. So make sure you stay tuned until the very end of the video. Let us begin. Alright, so the very first bag that would be on sale for tonight would be from Balenciaga. Yay! So, um, let me just pull her out. So, this is my Balenciaga bag and I'm sure you have seen her most of the time. So, here she is. So, let me just um, remove this one. So, this one is the Balenciaga XS Sharp Bag. Um, I purchased this one via Italis.com and so uh, the inclusion so the material of this one is made of genuine leather embossed of croc skin. So here it is. So here is the front. Oh, sorry guys, let me just focus this for you. So here is the front, here is the side, then the back. So you are going on notice guys on the back part here. There are slots because it comes with the strap here so this bag actually can be worn if i'm not mistaken four way so you could wear it as a clutch bag then you can attach it here at the back this strap here then you can wear this as a belt bag and then if we are going to open this bag it has another um what you call this loops here so if you're going to notice so there are loops over there so you could attach it over there and then you could wear this one as a shoulder bag so let me just show you an example just a quick um, example guys but I'm just if I have um, mud shots and photos I'm going to attach it over here as well on my side so here it is so it is a good shoulder bag all right and then actually if you have like let's say because this um, strap here is fully detachable if you have like a thin um, silver hardware shoulder strap or sling you could attach it here to the loop over here and you could also wear this one as a crossbody bag so um, again guys the reason why I'm selling this one because I from the time that I purchased this one via italis.com I've only used it once or twice but I think just once and mostly I've just you sit here at home for photo shoots and during our vlog so the condition of this one is still good as new so we, if we are going to take a look a little bit closer um there are no scuffings as you can see the material so there are no stickiness guys with this um bag here so i keep it stuffed with tissue paper so that um this guys by the way uh this is very structured unfortunately 
my big iPhone 6s plus will not fit here it could fit you could just remove this but if you have a smaller phone where's my smaller phone like for example the SE or 5s or the foldable phones and definitely um, it could fit here but most of us right um, we don't use our bags to fit our or to put in our phone so anyway this is bag number one so if you need more photos of this one please let me know all right the next bag that is on sale for tonight would be my YSL clutch bag so this one um, actually comes complete it doesn't it do, it just doesn't have the paper bag so here is the box it would come with the box so let me just open this for you if you haven't seen this one um, before the inclusion so it comes also with the Saint Laurent dust bag here one moment there then when we open here she is she is still very very pretty so here is the clutch bag and it comes with the fully detachable wristlet so it comes with one D ring over here so this is where you are going to attach this one over there the material of this one if I'm not mistaken if this is um, either Napa leather or lambskin because this um, leather is very very smooth so let me let me just show you again um, this one so I've used this a couple of times but currently right now because I'm trying to use more of the bigger bags that I have so most of the time this is just inside the box and it's just in storage so the ranking of this one I would still say that this is still very very good so you would see that the hardware is still very good um, no scratches um, visible scratches so um, so here let me just wipe it a little bit there are thumb marks so here is the very good um, gold rather zipper pull and then here is the back guys so can you see so again guys if you need more photos please do let me know i would be happy to send it to you so please do message me via messenger or via email so this is the top part here so this is the zip part sorry guys it's not focusing um there so here are the edges just to show you that it is still very very smooth there there it's focusing now there then of course if we are going to open so again I stop it with tissue so I purchased this one at YSL here in the Philippines so here it is so actually it has the how much you call this there's like a serial code over here at the um, but I couldn't show you because it's a little bit dark my apologies so the lining of this one it's not leather it's made of um, I think fabric or canvas so um what are the inclusions of this one so we have of course the bag the box the dust bag then it, it's come it comes complete here so it comes with the leather swatch it comes with the cards over here the authenticity cards etc so this one guys um what i love about this one because yes this is a clutch bag but i've done a styling uh of this one so i'm going to put a photo here and link it on the description box because you could use this one as a sling the technique is so for example if you're thinking that you would not be able to use it as a sling definitely you can so what you need to do is just to um make sure that the clutch is open because you could attach one sling here or one what do you call this um, closure over here on the B ring on this part and then you could attach the other one at this part here there and then you could wear it as a sling as a crossbody bag again let me put the photo over here there so this is bag number two YSL all right so for bag number three that is on sale for tonight would be my Kenzo utility belt bag so I purchased this one brand new at Kenzo when we went to um, Taipei in Taiwan so let me just pull her out so again this comes complete so we have the paper bag sorry dust bag and I believe the cards are also inside let me just double check so here is the um, dust bag so this utility belt bag it comes with three SLG so we have the circle for white again guys the material is genuine everything is genuine leather so we have this for the white one a circle then the black one uh, sorry the black one you would see it comes with the Kenzo um, embossing over here so that is the black 
And then the patent leather. So the triangle here. So again, Kenzo. And then it comes with a very soft. So I'm not really sure of what leather this is. So I'm thinking um, calf skin because it's very smooth, guys. So this is an actual belt that you could use. And what you just need to do, I'm going to attach maybe just photos to make it quick. But definitely, um, since this is a belt bag, you can actually attach. Let me just do it really, really quick. So here, so there are all of the SLGs on the Kenzo. It has their belt loops over here. So all you need to do, of course, is just slip the belt. So you can wear it, you know, individually like this. So like, for example, um, today I am feeling just the one um, SLGs or maybe I am feeling two or maybe I am feeling three or I'm just feeling this too. So actually you could style this um, any way that you want it. So um, before I describe more, let me just see what are the inclusions. So here is um, the uh, card that it comes with. Let me just double check guys, one moment. So there, so it comes with the cards. There, the Kenzo cards there so those are what's included on this bag so again going back to the SLGs themselves so this one the black part here this is like a zippy wallet so again I'm done a review on this one I'm going to link it on the description box below so this one I believe you can put your cash your credit cards over this one out of the three SLGs I super super love this one I feel that um, I would be able to use it on a daily basis and guys by the way like what I mentioned I purchased this one brand new at Taipei but to be honest when I purchased this one I wasn't able to use it as much um, I was only able to use it at one fashion event and then that's it then most of the time would just be here at home during my home shoots um, so basically um, the condition of this one is still very good so as you can see with the black one so there are no stickiness over here so here is the flap so here is the the Kenzo embossing over here so this is black smooth leather and it's lined with leather as well so again here's the back part and then the zipper pull it's made of genuine leather as well then let's go to the circle parts so again this is genuine leather um, mimicking the snakeskin pattern over here so leather zipper pull so you could just put it like this so again it has this thingy over here where you can slip in the um, what you call this? Oh, okay. So this one, guys, I just have to make mention. So this is the first time that I'm noticing this. So unfortunately, for the lining of the Kenzo, this one, it's starting to crack already. Wow. So this is the first time that I'm noticing. So I want it to be as much, you know, to be honest with you guys with this one. Because, of course, if you're going to purchase this one, I want to disclose everything if there are, like, flaws. But basically everything is good. So for this one, it's a little bit tricky. Maybe what you could put here are just bills. And um, I'm not sure if card would fit in. So this is the white one. So this one also comes embossed. And then the last SLG would be this one, which would be good maybe for your Air AirPods, coins, or maybe gum. There. So this is what it looks like inside. So inside, guys, this one okay so this is the first time i'm also noticing this so on this part over here oh it's not showing but there is a little bit cracking over at this part can you see that guys so there so it has a silver hardware so let me just double check the black one if it has um cracking as well yes oh my god it has so over here guys on the accordion part it's starting to crack a little bit oh that's yes but i think so i'm actually the this one the good news about this one i'm selling this one very very low again i'm putting it there and then for the belt it's still in very good condition nothing to report about the belt the closure or the buckle is of silver hardware so if you need more photos of this one and of course like for example the dimension of the belt um, please do message me and I'll be happy to send them to you. Alright, so this is for Kenzo Belt. Alright, for the next bag that would be on sale for tonight would be the Jean Batista XHM um, collaboration. So here she is. So this one, 
guys this is from my personal collection and honestly when I purchased this one from uh, during the VIP party of Jambatista Valley X H and M, I never used this. So this is good as brand new. So comes complete um, paper bag. So again, I like what I mentioned. I never used this one. It comes with the tag still. So here, so it comes with the tag. There it comes with the tag. Is it focusing? And then, so this one actually is would be a perfect so this is made of um, acrylic there so this is a clear acrylic over here and then this one it says love so the writing is love so as you could see me inside here on top the closure it's silver then the engraving of Jambatisa Valley is over there so you could the straps it comes with two straps so we have the longer straps so the longer strap is you could wear it as a crossbody so this is definitely a good if evening bag then it comes with a shoulder strap over here let me just pull it out one second there so this is the shorter strap that it comes with and then what else guys okay so like what I mentioned this is still considered as brand new because I've never used this even once so here is my 6s plus so it fits perfectly so if people would be asking there so this would be a good um, party clutch so you could remove the strap and you could carry it like this you could carry it as a crossbody then using this one you could carry it as a top handle there. So this is Jambatisa bag. Alright, moving on to the next bag that we would be selling tonight would be um, my vintage Celine. Um, I'm not sure if this is vanity bag. So this one, among the bags that I'll be showing you today, this is the one that I purchased only pre-love. So because of course it's vintage, you cannot purchase this on stores anymore. I like it because I like the size. I like um, how it looks and it's, you know, the vintage Triumph. Is it the Triumph? The um, logo of Celine over here. So you are going to notice this is the logo of Celine. So it's, she's not really that gold anymore. So there's a little bit of tarnishing of the logo here. Um, the material of this one is coated canvas. So mostly this is coated canvas and it comes with the leather trim. So it's leather. The dark brown here would be the leather trims over here, the piping, and of course the handle over here. So let us just discuss first if there are major scuffings with this bag. So here is the zipper. So if you're going to notice, it comes also just like the vintage Chanel. So it comes with the medallion and then shows the two CC. So it's not focusing, guys. Sorry, guys. So there. So here is the front. Let me just. I'm going to put a photo right beside me so you could see the size of this one. So I've used this one when I purchased this pre-love one time during the H&M X Jump Batista Valley party. So this was the bag that I was carrying. So here is the side. Here is the back. The top part with the top handle over here. So it doesn't come with any bearing. So definitely this is a top handle bag. but. There are no more issues with that because I believe if, like for example, you have the um, the attachment, right? You could maybe attach it here so you could attach um, um, a sling. So it comes with a, so this one, it's a button, a snap closure. Then it comes up with a pocket in front there. So it comes with that one. And then at the back, it doesn't come with any pocket. And then when you open, so let me just show you guys. Oh wait, before I show you, so here are some of the scratches. We call it scratches or scuffings on this part here because of course guys, um, this is already vintage Celine. So I'm not really sure guys like how, what is the year of production this, this Celine bag is. So I keep it stuck with this one with um, fabric over here. So here is what it looks like inside. So can you see? So here is V. There it says there. Celine Paris over there. So it comes with one zipper compartment 
on this one. So the lining of this one, it's very, very smooth leather. So I'm not sure, I'm, I'm thinking this is leather or just a wipeable interior. So that is that one. So let me just close it again, just to show you that even though without the stuffings, it's still very structured there very structured so again if you need more photos please do let me know i'll be happy to send it to you so this is for the celine bag all right so the next bag on sale would be another clutch from com de gasson so this one we purchased brand new at com de gasson here in the philippines so this one comes complete in this was only used one so it comes with the original um, paper bag then it comes also with the com de gasson box so let me just open. So this one, I haven't done any reviews or anything like that. Um, so we use silicon gel so to make sure that, you know, it's... So these are the cards that it comes with. So, so there. And then it actually comes with the original price here. But again, of course... I'm just going to put how much we are selling this for. So it comes with tissue. So this would be very good. Like for example, you have like um, a small event or an area that you need to go to. So here she is. How cute. I love the print. I kind of forgot um, this print already. So as you are going to notice, here's the logo Com de Gasson. So this is the classic print of Com. Um, the polka dot, I super love it. So again, the zipper pull. Can you see that, guys? There. So here is the back. So this one is made of genuine leather as well. So I'm just double inspecting. So the glazing is still very good on the side. Here is the um, bottom edge. So you are going to notice. I'm not seeing, guys, like what I mentioned, I'm trying to be as honest as I can. But I'm not seeing um, any like huge scratches or anything. Actually, this one is still very pristine. I'm not seeing anything at all. So there are a couple of scratches here. So there, so I can see one here. I'm not sure if the camera is capturing. So there is a small one over here, but maybe that could still be buffed out with um, a microfiber um, cloth. Then another one here. So there are two. So let us try. Oh, wait, what is this? So there is a slight. I'm not sure if this is glue. There. So there is a glue. So. We'll try to check it out if that could still be removed. The zipper is very smooth. So it comes with its own, what's this, padding. And lots of silica gel. So unlike the YSL, this doesn't come with any wristlet. But if you have a um, wristlet attachment, then definitely you can just simply hook it here at the zipper pull. Because it has, you know, that all over there. So this is what it looks like on the inside. So this is made in Spain. So it shows here made in Spain. There. So this is the Com de Gasson. Alright, the next bag on sale would be from Moschino. So let me just get her. So this Moschino we purchased, if I'm not mistaken, in Shanghai, yes. Because this is the... After we watched or seen the Louis Vuitton Boule Bouge Voyages exhibition in Shanghai, there is this luxury mall across it and we there is a Moschino store so we got it from there so this one also comes complete so of course we have the paper bag we have the dust bag so this one I haven't done a review so if you want more photos on this one please do let me know but I'm going to send a put a tag or photos here for a reference of the size so here she is so this, the material of this one, again, purchased brand new from Moschino store. It's not the Moschino outlet, guys. It is the real Moschino store. So the material of this one, it's made of canvas with leather trim. So the leather trim would be this part here. Then it has the clochette. So what's inside? This circle thingy over here. So this is like um, clochette thingy attachment. And then, the silver hardware. Then, of course, the signature giant Moschino, uh, Moschino zippers. So, it has two zippers. So, let me just open. 
So, so you can attach it multiple ways, all he did. So, here we have the authenticity cards. Silica gel in inside. So, here it is, Moschino. Moschino Milano. So, just to show you what fits inside, here is my phone again. So, it fits perfectly without any issues. Can you see, guys? And it has more. So, definitely, this is um, a very good bag that you are going to purchase because you can attach the strap. So, the strap is here. So, it's made of, is this what? Made of fabric can uh, or canvas. So, it's engraved with Moschino logo all over. Then, you know, there's leather trim. Then, of course, the very shiny silver hardware. So, you could attach it. So, you could wear this one crossbody as a bum bag. Or you could, because this strap here is, um, what you call this? Fully adjustable. So, maybe you could wear this one as a bum handle. Over it. Oh, sorry. Not there. Here, on top, on this part. There, so here she is. How beautiful, right? So as you are going to notice, um, the entirety of the bag. So there is the Moschino Milano logo. So this is this is the front, the side, the back, bottom part. So this is this was only used once. So I'm just inspecting, guys, if there is anything to report with the hardware. So hardware, I'm not seeing any major scratches at all also with the leather the um, leather trims with the canvas as well there are no stains it's still it still looks new and brand new so i would rate this bag as very good so hopefully um i would feel you know very happy if i'm going to purchase this one there so this is the moschino bag Right, the next bag on sale would be from Mark by Mark Jacob. So we purchased it here from Manila, directly from the store. So we purchased this one brand new. So this one doesn't have a paper bag, but it comes with a dust bag. So let me just check what are the inclusions. So here is the bag. So I haven't done a review yet, guys, for this one. Um, it comes with the... So this one is made of 100% genuine cowhide leather comes with the fully detachable um, leather strap so the leather strap is adjustable that's nice so it comes with the two D rings on the side so let me just attach it you could wear this one as a crossbody or a shoulder bag or if you have um, maybe another attachment a top handle strap you could use it so you could carry this as a top handle bag so here is the V Tab, and then you are going to see Mark by Mark Jacob. So this one we are selling very low. Um, there's no Mark. Is there? I think it's just Mark Jacobs now, right? So this was um, the diffusion line of Mark Jacobs before. So the lining is fabric. So here are the. Oh, okay. So here are what's included aside from the dust bag. So it has the cards. So here are the cards and then here is inside. So you're going to notice we put a lot of silica gels because we don't want anything, you know, molds or anything like that to happen with the bag. So here, fabric lining. Unfortunately, let me just double check because like what I mentioned, I haven't done a review on this one. If my phone would fit, so the bigger phones would not unfortunately but if you have the smaller phones like um, SE it would fit I believe so um, or maybe the foldable phones but definitely this would be a very good bag to put in your credit card your lipstick um, some hand sanitizer so again let us double inspect the back for um, close-up detail so you are going to see that there are graining I love leather grains like this one because it it kind of makes the bag a little bit more um, scratch resistant right so this is the side so this is the where you're going to attach the shoulder strap and then at the back so it doesn't have any pockets at all so another side 
Then this is the bottom part. So actually, it's shaped like um, what you call this? The Chanel Le Boy sideways. So let us check if there are major scuffings on the bottom part. So there are none. So you are going to see that the glazing is still in very good condition. So we we have used this one quite a bit but of course um, if you know me guys I really do take care of my luxury bag even if it's just Marc Jacobs I still do take care of this one just like a baby so there so so let me just make double inspect guys if there are anything that I could report to you okay so let me just inspect what's that if I could wipe it because there is one stain at the hardware at the bottom part. So I'm not sure if that would or if camera would capture this one. But there is one tiny, tiny speck of stain here on the hardware. So I'm not sure. Let me just double check if I could still wipe it. Maybe that's just superficial stain. Or maybe... Yeah, I'm not really sure. I think it's um, because when you close this one so you need to slide it in and then when you open you have to push this one so you could open so maybe that's that's what the stain is because of the scratching of the metals over here but aside from that one i'm double inspecting so the glazing there is no cracking the smell still very good oh surprisingly it's still very good it's still smells brand new. I love the smell of genuine leather. So this is for the Marc Jacobs. If you want more photos, please let me know. Uh, message me via Instagram. I'll be happy to send it to you. Alright, so the next bag would be from Gucci. Let me get her out. So, so here she is on the dust bag. So this is still the classic dust bag. Okay. So I'm going to link the review of this one on the description box below. So this is made of coated canvas with leather trim. So this doesn't come. So this is a Gucci tote bag. Again, purchased at our Gucci stores here in Philippines. In the Philippines. Um, so over here, this is the front part. So with my review, because the way initially we have hidden this bag or store it, the straps were kept like this and what happened was it left a mark on the canvas so I'm not sure if the camera would see so there should be a mark over here so this is the front and then at the back there is also a mark of the there on this part here of the strap but you know it's still um it doesn't look really that bad or that awful but the leather strips or leather part is very good i don't see any cracking the hardware is got metal so again it's a little it's not really heavy so maybe if i'm but if you're going to put stuff here then definitely it will be a lot heavier so i i remember i've used this one when we traveled it's a little bit difficult to carry um during traveling so what we did was because again it doesn't come with a a sling or a shoulder strap so you could still attach a shoulder strap so there are uh, buckles here two buckles in front and then two buckles at the back so you could attach it there and then on the top part um, there is a zippered compartment so let me just open this for you the zipper compartment you could fully detach it so this is actually um, if you're able to attach a shoulder strap then this would be a nice travel bag because it's very spacious so your laptop could fit in a water bottle this would also be a very good work bag. Um, I would be recommending that. So the lining um, here is fabric. Fabric lining. Then it comes with the logo. There. Then the back part here. So with the back part. So guys, I would still rate this very good. Maybe around 
Aside from this one, I would still rate it 8 over 10. So this is the Gucci bag. If you need more photos, please do let me know. would we'll be very, very happy to send it to you. Alright, so the next bag on sale, so it would be for Prada. So we have three bags under Prada. So the very first one, so this comes, um, well, actually not complete, so it doesn't have a box. So this is my Prada Blue Camera bag, but it comes with, of course, the paper bag. Then here is the um, bag. Then, of course, it comes with the um, detachable shoulder strap. So the detachable shoulder strap comes with its very own dust bag. So the camera bag doesn't come with its own dust bag, but it comes with the tissue of Prada. So here she is. Let me just um, attach it very, very quick. So it comes with two um, B rings. So again, this was purchased directly at Prada Green Belt. So it's not an outlet store, you guys. Um, the reason why I am selling this very beautiful Prada bag is because unfortunately, um, it is a little bit small. So the year that I purchased this one before, this phone that I have is a 5s so it's a little bit smaller so unfortunately phones bigger um, like the 6s plus would not fit so let us check the quality of the bag so again the material of this one is a piano leather so i just have it stuffed with tissue paper let me just remove it so i could show you there so it comes of course with the authenticity cards here are the authenticity cards, guys. So it's complete. So again, it's the the thing that would be not included on this one would be the box. So let me just close it again. So here is the front, guys. So it's made of Safiano leather. So the hardware is still very good. So I would be rating this bag 9 over 10. Um, there are no major scratches or anything as you know uh, Safiano leather is very scratch resistant even though you do this it would not leave any scratch mark so the hardware is still very gold so I've done um, I'm going to put a photo here because I've done a styling uh, thing of this one where you could attach two straps one would be the shoulder strap and then um, a, short, a shorter strap here so you could carry this as a top handle which I really really love when transformed so here is the back part and then the bottom part would be very important to show you to see if there are major scratches or scuffings or discoloration so bottom part you would see is still very clean there there so there are very very minimal signs of usage for this bag and then once we open so here she is she has the blue interior with the Prada logo enamel here so two pockets so this is the Prada camera bag so if you want more photos I'm going to show it or just message me and I would be happy to send it to you guys all right next from Prada would be of course it comes complete with um, so this one doesn't have any box again so it comes with paper bag dust bag so this is actually a Prada promenade bag but this is um, a different color because um, the other color that I have is silver so I'm keeping that one so this one we are going to sell and the color of this one so this is a mini size this is uh, what you call it? maybe dark it's not blue blue so it's a little bit darker than blue so you're going to see here so it comes with this one so to protect the bag when you're keeping it and storing it and of course it comes with its own detachable strap as well that comes with its very own uh, what you call that dust bag sorry guys again the strap of this one it's the same color as this one I love the color so the strap is fully adjustable and detachable so let us check the bag and inspect so I love the gold hardware. So this is the front. It comes with this one, of course, the attachment here, the clochette. So the logo of Prada, that's nice. The front, 
side, back, the bottom part. So let us inspect the bottom part guys because normally this is where it would show the signs of usage. So what can you see guys? Still very good. Not a lot. So again, the material is um, Sapiano leather and we purchased this directly at Greenbelt or rather at Prada. Okay, so let me just double check the inside. So the glazing is still good. So here are the cards, the authenticity card, then here is the fabric interior with one zip, oh no, not zippered, but there is one slip pocket on this side. As you can see, it's glimmering. That is the logo of Prada inside. There. So if you want more photos, I'm going to send, um, ah, okay, so what fits inside. So this one, guys, this is the 6S Plus. Normally, if I would be carrying the silver version of this one. I would just be putting it like this that the phone would be standing up so um, you could still put in your phone but you cannot put it entirely or maybe like this and then you just don't close the zipper and then you could carry it like this one so again it comes with the fully detachable strap photos can be sent upon request there so this is still very nice I'm double inspecting so it, it you know there are signs of a little bit of scuffings but again we've had this for a couple of years now but in general I would still be rating this 8 over 10 all right last but not the least for Prada so again this one comes complete so we have paper bag box so this one I actually made a review I'm going to link it up here so unfortunately there is just this coloration with the box but this is the hard box of Prada um, so this is the front, the back part, so this is the, there, so it comes also with the tissue paper, I'm opening guys so you can see, then it comes with the very beautiful um, silk dust bag, it's so nice, here she is, so can you see, then three, two, one, I really love this there so now we are selling this one guys the material of this one is if i'm not mistaken is either lambskin or calfskin because it's very smooth so let us inspect the bag first so we purchased this one brand new in prada green belt so this is the front so the enamel logo of prada so you could there is a slip here so you could carry it so this is actually a clutch bag um so you could carry it like this it like this is very stylish guys and then here is the back so with the back so there is a zipper compartment so it comes with of course silica gel so there you can put your credit cards so let me just check if the phone can actually fit at the back so no the phone cannot fit at the back but good news is on top here so let me just remove the tissue so here are the cards, authenticity cards guys. So here is what it looks like inside. It comes with two pockets, so one huge uh, main compartment and then one zippered um, pocket and then there's another slip pocket over here. So this is the zippered pocket and then main compartment. And then you could put, uh, sorry guys, you could put your phone here. And then you have more space, so just to show you there so i have done a styling video or a vlog for this one because definitely you could attach um shoulder straps so like for example let me just use the other shoulder strap from the first product so all you need to do the trick is so it has two zippers so one on top and then one on this um, back here so put them separately so at the back just maintain that it's open and on the top there on the zipper you're going to notice that there so all you need to do just give me one second guys snap it on one there so so yes it's a clutch bag but definitely you could attach one on the zipper here and the other here and then so just you could wear it as a 
cross body back, shoulder back. I'm just going to put again photos here for more inspiration. So let us double check. So the rating of this one, I would say we, I think if I'm not mistaken, we only use this once on one fashion show. And then she is just kept hidden. So there are no major scuffing. So here is the bottom part, the most important because you're going to see if there are scuffing, especially with material like this. If you're not very careful, you will be able to scratch this one easily. But like what I mentioned, we are very, very careful with our luxury bag. That is why, yes, we purchased this one maybe three, four years ago, but the condition is still very, very good. And I will still be rating this one nine over 10 there so hopefully I would you know recommend this one for you guys because this is still in very good condition there how did you like our part two of the mega sale eleganza extravaganza so again guys just a disclaimer the price that I posted here shipping is not included um, so definitely uh, the prices we are going to add shipping if you are here from Manila I would just let's just communicate via Instagram so I could share to you guys how much the shipping fee is and then for my international subscribers if you want to purchase any of the bags here so the prices that I'm noting here I will be including also the um, in Philippine pesos and in US dollars but if for example you're from Australia just let me know where you are located and I could provide you the conversion to your currency plus of course um, please take note that the prices noted here also um, shipping is not included so currently right now uh, we are going to use FedEx um, to ship internationally but for locally we use either LBC or via Grab Express. Anyway, if you need more photos or videos or measurement like what I mentioned, please DM me via Instagram. It's here. Um, here is my Instagram account. Please message me there or email me. But best guys would be on Instagram because I'm always um, online via Instagram. If you have questions, I would love to hear from you. And hopefully, I'm looking for new wonderful and loving parents of um, our luxury bags I mentioned most of the bag actually among the bags that I'm showing you there's only one bag there that I purchased pre-love which is the Celine um, vintage bag but all of them we purchased um, brand new from the stores directly and I could assure you guys that we have taken care of them most of them um, we just use once and there are bags that we didn't use at all after we purchased this one so this is actually the reason why I am looking for wonderful loving new parents for this one so hopefully I would hear from you guys and if you have questions please do let me know alright so guys again I'm inviting you to please join our growing family by clicking this cute little icon here and I would be happy to welcome you to our growing and loving family also guys please do smash that notification bell I publish um, vlogs twice a week every Wednesdays and Saturdays for shopping vlogs also I would highly appreciate it if you could like this video also please do follow me on instagram.com for slash Amirify so you could stay uh, we could stay updated and we could communicate directly Alright, so again, thank you guys for staying with me in this episode. So again, please do check our part one where we have our luxury accessories and, um, that we are selling as well. So I would see you on our next episode. Please do stay safe always. Bye!